Hey guys, what's up Libra? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future. In the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energy can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading or a phone reading, that's below as well. Alright, media future for Libra, please. Seven of Wands. Nine of Swords. The Ace of Swords. Alright. Something is somebody's a little I mean somebody's defensive. It's not like overly powering energy. Um they feel like, you know, you gotta protect yourself, guard yourself. There's something here that's really got somebody worried, but the answers are coming or the communication's coming. So don't don't get caught in anxiety if you can help it. Show me the seven of wands, because with the ace of swords there, one way or another, that's that's the that's the truth, that's the clarity. The six of cups. Looks like you do have communication coming in. Could be from a Scorpio. Doesn't have to be though. Tell me more about this. This this just um the Ace of Pentacles. Alright, so what's happening? The devil's at the bottom. So Capricorn energy. It looks like this is someone uh for some, this could be a drinker, it could be a water sign. Um, not for all, but this could be a cycle that you've already broke. It could just be that you're dealing with a Capricorn. But this is something trying to this could be a friendship, like uh, something to do with somebody from back in the day, but it, it could just be, you know, somebody that you really cared about. There's an opportunity to like reinvent something, to make it, um, to make plans, to hire Fantaurus energy. Tell me about that Ace of Pentacles for Libra, the Hierophant again. Energy. Tell me more about the um, offer. You may have um, the Queen of Wands. That's your energy. You could be done with the Aries Leo Sag. You may have. Uh, it could have had something to do with like if this was something that like um, because of like higher values, maybe religious values. Um, could have had something to do with somebody's like, parents didn't approve. Um, not in all situations, but it looks like for some, this is an apology. Definitely could be from a Virgo or somebody that you work with, maybe somebody that you met online. Show me this nine of swords for, um, Libra, please. Alright, so Pisces energy with the hangman. Somebody's been thinking about this like crazy, kind of stuck. And it's almost like that mindset is what keeps things stuck. With the um, the hangman, like I said, associated with Pisces, that is, that, that's like a card of uh, almost illusion. Yeah, the devil. Alright, Capricorn energy. So basically what's happening here is, yeah, it looks like you broke the cycle before. For some, you have somebody like that's kind of been falling back drinking, or I mean, it can be meditating, but it's like worried so much, so that's kind of what somebody's like turned to. But it's definitely, um, and not in all cases, but showing the devil, there's like an obsession going on here. The King of Pentacles, so it definitely could be an Earth sign, but this also could be somebody who, uh, for some, could be really possessive. Um, doesn't 
cost could be possessive. It could be somebody who maybe is materialistic or really likes, like, um, that's somebody. Let me give you an example. Because I'm going to go with all this vocabulary. Um, think about, like, and this is just an example, just apply it. Like a hoarder. <laughs> Doesn't like to let go of things, to lose things like that. And so with the obsession here and that kind of energy, um, unless you're just dealing with the Capricorn, but that's why somebody's sitting here stressing so much. But it's kind of like somebody's been like falling back. Maybe to materialistic things, maybe to, um, like I said, drinking or something, but they can't get you off their mind. Show me this Ace of Swords. So Libra. The Six of Wands. Looks like somebody's realizing. Um, oh, I mean, shoot, you got the Sun and the Six of Wands. That's a hell of a, a lot of happiness. Tell me more about this outcome. The Knight of Wands. Could be dealing with a younger fire sign. You're really, you could be like seen in the public eye or doing something big there. You're moving forward incredibly quickly. Cancer energy with the chariot. I'm trying to see if it's like going anywhere. Like the wheel. It's moving on its own time. Divine timing. For some, your career could really be taken off pretty freaking quickly. So is there any, um, cause this is, this is really fast, but I don't see anything like, besides travel, uh, King of Wands, I mean, this person definitely matches your energy, you definitely could have somebody who is very physical, but maybe, uh, could be a married man. But also for some, they could, you know, really need that stability. Is somebody with a lot of pride, a lot of ego, and like I said, won't like to lose things. Definitely could be some obsession here. Could be traveling, coming over, but you know, it's, it, I mean, things are trying to move forward. The opportunity is here. Feels so like like something with this situation might like always get to a point where it hits like a speed bump or, or something like that. Alright, Libra, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.